Radio Lewis. Wi-Fi Radio. It is indeed Radio Lewis, and it is indeed available via all brands of Wi-Fi, if that makes sense. It's my great pleasure to welcome Lisa Giles. No, not Giles, Giles, isn't it? Lisa Giles. Giles. I wonder if that's where Giles came from, Lisa. I'm, I'm not sure. No, no, I, th- I think I have French origins, actually. Yeah, you, you do. Good, I'm pleased Gilles. to hear that. Gil, 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 yeah. Gil, yeah. Excellent. Now, Lisa, you're, um, you've got a workshop coming up at Westgate Chapel on Saturday, the 27th of April, and this is to do with your musical uh, endeavours, uh, teaching and playing, um, including with the wonderful... Scartoons. Can you tell me about the workshop? Yeah, sure. Well, the idea for the workshop came from uh, my pupils, actually. I teach saxophone and clarinet privately. And I teach a lot of adult pupils uh, who have very different levels of experience and very different things that they want to do. But often they would tell me that there's no chance for them to get together with other people and to play music. Uh, particularly if often your options really for that are sort of to join an amateur music making ensemble for which there's often a kind of minimum entry requirement um, and a certain expectation of reading music or maybe um, to join a kind of more kind of band based thing I know that Starfish run ensembles for adults and that's more of a kind of in sort of pop music vein um, so I think this is for people who just want to sort of play and experiment on their instruments in an ensemble and, um, yeah, create their own music, really. And what sort of in- instruments are we talking about for this? I would like to be open to anything, really. I mean, I think um, percussionists as well. I think it's going to be the type of music that we end up making together will simply depend on who's there. So we could have, you know, six violins and a tuba. We could have a, a keyboard and a piccolo and whatever, really. And, and what sort of genre of music would you think? I'd like, I'd like the ensemble to be as free as possible, really, in sort of the widest sense. So if people had a particular genre that they love, for instance, if they love ska, we, we could try and incorporate that into pieces. But I think it would... Always the genre is going to have to reflect who's there in the room. So then uh, we might end up playing a bit of ska that might then mutate into some prog rock and then might mutate into some, some kind of contemporary classical music. It's, uh, that's the exciting thing, really. I think it's, uh, we're going to see how the music develops. Uh, I think it'd be very interesting to hear Scar played on the tuba. I can't imagine what that would be like. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yes, there's ways and means. I'm yeah, sure no, there I'm... is. <laughs> yeah, yeah, we could. We could do anything. Great. And um, what's the cost? It's £20 for this initial workshop, which is a two-hour workshop. And if people want to take this further and sort of make an ensemble that meets regularly... Uh, then I think, yeah, we would talk then as an ensemble about, you know, how regular people want to make it and the length of session that works for people and sort of go from there. This is just a kind of initial trial, really. It sounds fantastic. Um, Thank you. How do people book? Where do do they get? Well, um, I think uh, I've got an advert coming out in in Viva Lewis and there's also going to be a a couple of posters around town and I've, I've put my email address on there and my website and people can book um, I think my phone number's on there too so people can just just contact me and I think a lot of people might want to talk a bit about their what they do and their level of experience because that can be so different and often even my own pupils you know can be quite worried about coming along to something like this and thinking that oh you know am I good enough or you know I haven't really done this and haven't done that but um, really it genuinely is for everybody I mean, if you can play a few notes on your instrument you can come along okay well I can't play a few notes on an instrument but that's, a, <laughs> well, that's another I'd, I'd story I'd even like to develop I'd like to develop it so that 
people who didn't play instruments could come too. I mean, another inspiration for this project has been a, a recent project that I've carried out at Chaley Heritage Special Needs School. Um, it was a, a collaboration between Chaley Heritage and Chaley Secondary, where we had four profoundly disabled young people working with four able-bodied young people, making instruments together and playing together. And we had some awesome music that was produced, which just showed to me how there really are no barriers. There shouldn't be any barriers to music making. Um, I'd like to think about that in future. If anybody wants to come and uh, doesn't play a standard instrument, then I think we should be able to incorporate that. That sounds really exciting. And can you give the web address, please, Lisa? Yes, it's Lewis Woodwind one word lewiswoodwind.co.uk okay lewiswoodwind.co.uk and that's saturday the 27th of april at yeah. uh, between three and five p.m and 20 pounds and at the westgate chapel that's right yeah okay lisa thank you very much for that and good luck with cartoons and everything else you do and thanks thanks, thanks for talking today brilliant thanks very much bye